Hey, we're here in the makerspace in Delft of the Science Center and they had a couple of sheets of plastic that they normally use for the laser cutter but they have no idea what type of plastic it is. It are sheets that either students previously brought in or they somehow were left over on the project. And we want to see if we can identify it with the new prototype of the plastic scanner uh, to make sure that they can reuse it, have the right settings for the laser cutter and uh, yeah, be able to, to use the different plastic sheets. We already did a little round, but we're going to see if we can identify them on the spot. Uh, here I have the plastic scanner, I already did sort of a little calibration step and basically now because they are transparent sheets we put a little bit of reference material on the back and then we put the plastic scanner on there, we press scan and it says that this is a, most likely a PET sheet which we also believe due to the, the characteristics of the sheet. Uh, here we have another sheet which also uh, looks like it's PET um, and this also matches our expectations. Another reading which is a little bit more confident that it is actually PET. Here we have one sheet, we peeled back the protective layer so we really have a scan on the surface. Here it says it's polycarbonate and Earlier we identified it as PET, so it's still not fully, uh, it's not, still not fully correct. But we're gonna do one more test. Calibrate done. Put it on there. Polycarbonate. So this one is still a bit uncertain. Here we have one more, where we also peel back the protective sheet scan it and here it's very certain that it's polycarbonate um, and that's also correct we looked up this Lexan sheet and it online it also states that it's uh, a polycarbonate sheet um, so that's a trial of our uh, new plastic scanner prototype decent results not fully correct yet uh, still uh, some improvements to be made but uh, it's nice to have a real world uh, application here at the to make space. So uh, thanks for watching.